tone is amazing feature but sometimes when you edit videos or photos then you just want to have it turned off but uh, to turn it on or off you have to go to settings and it takes uh, some time and you have to click through all these settings uh, so I need uh, the easier way to turn it on and off and I thought uh, what can I do my first solution was to just use uh, automator and uh, record uh, me going through settings Uh, it wasn't really efficient, but it worked. Uh, so this was my first idea. But then I thought that uh, how can I make it faster and uh, simpler, easier. Uh, and uh, I've used the uh, Apple script in Automator. So uh, now I have just uh, two clicks on a touch bar to turn uh, True Tone on or off. Uh, and I can use uh, this amazing feature whenever I want uh, and uh, if I need uh, it uh, turned off then I can just uh, click True Tone button and uh, it turns itself off so here is uh, what I did so here is what you have to do open automator or you can just search for it Create new document and select quick action, choose. Uh, and in old version, I uh, just had to hit record uh, and then uh, do all of this stuff. But uh, in new version, it's much simpler. New version, you have to add uh, run Apple script uh, and then paste this code. Uh, what it does, uh, it uh, tells uh, to open system preferences, uh, go to displays uh, and uh, click on first uh, checkbox. Uh, in this case, it would be the one that we need. Uh, and then quit uh, preferences. Uh, also, you can hear uh, change the icon and uh, the color of the button on the touch bar uh, and the name you give to this workflow why, uh, when you save it that would be the, the description to the button thanks for watching this video hope you liked it if you did give it this video a thumbs up subscribe if you are new and see you in a in the next video. Bye!